You could call it CSI meets Helter Skelter. Forensic investigators say the notorious mass murderer Charles Manson may have had even more victims. Those investigators want to dig up the ranch where Manson and his cult of followers were arrested back in 1969. George Lewis is following the story from Burbank Bureau. I mean, George, how do you get this far away from that big story and find out perhaps there are more people buried at the Manson Ranch? Well, the guy with the dog you just saw there is Sergeant Paul Costi of uh, Mammoth Lakes, California Police Department. He's visited the ranch seven times because he's been hearing the rumors that have been swirling for years about uh, possible other victims of the Manson family. He says that his dog, Buster, uh, alerted on three different sites at the ranch indicating uh, the presence of decomposing human remains there. They followed up with a team from Oak Ridge National Laboratory that was using sophisticated uh, equipment to, to to check for those kinds of odors and on three of those sites they did find odors consistent with decomposing human bodies. Now Costi says that's enough evidence that the local sheriff ought to get out there and start digging with a backhoe. The problem is that Inyo County, California where this ranch is located is very poor. The sheriff doesn't want to spend money unless there's evidence of other possible murders out there. There has been no independent evidence of that. Other dog teams have gone out there and, and uh, they did not alert at the same sites where Paul Costi's dog alerted. So the mystery continues, Contessa. All right, George, thanks for bringing us up to date on what you know so far.